It is an honor and a blessing to have been given the opportunity to share my message with you today. I want to extend a warm welcome to the administrative staff, school faculty, our families, our friends, and our classmates, the graduating class of 2015. High School North has brought about ups and downs in each of you. You have all taken a variety of classes and electives here. Some of these classes will pass us by the minute we walk out of those classrooms for the final time. But for the select few classes that you truly enjoyed, those memories will live on for a lifetime. Whether the teacher had a special way of interacting with the students, the assignments and activities were engaging and informative, or you got a chance to bond with your classmates there, these classes truly make an impact in your lives, whether they serve as a challenging motivator, bonding experience, or even a stress reliever. Remember not only your greatest accomplishments, remember how you strive for those goals, how you spent long nights studying for a major exam you did well on, how you pushed your body beyond their limits, training for a competition you won first place in, how you made big sacrifices to make ends meet. Be proud of your rewards, no matter how small. Also, remember your mistakes and failures, how you're minutely close to that one score, how those extra hours just could not pay off, how everything just suddenly fell apart. Not all aspects of your life can be perfect, and not all events can fall under your control. Your life is not human without mistakes. The actions you take to overcome adversity truly define your image, not the final outcome. Great achievements make a great first impression. Great character makes a great lasting impression. Our lives would not be whole without the help of three important groups of people. Your parents, first and foremost, have nurtured you since birth and have provided you shelter and nourishment. They have paid for your extracurricular expenses, driven you to countless games and parties, and have given you their best word on developing a good character. No matter how much bickering goes on in the family, how much hatred you may seem to exchange, recall that they will always have your best interests at heart. In your education, your favorite instructors have gone above and beyond the curriculum in helping you grow not only in the subject of the course, but also in the advice and life lessons they provide you. They not only gave you the course material, but they also gave extra time, perhaps to tutor you in a different manner that you understand, or just to share a laugh or two. And last but not least, your best friends are people whom you can always count on to share hidden secrets and passions. While your parents and instructors have all the experience to mentor you, they cannot be around forever. Your best friends, however, will keep in touch with you for the most, if not all, of your life. So, sometime in the future, do something special to formally acknowledge the people that matter to you the most. Before we leave, let us take one final look at high school, but from the perspective of a Rubik's Cube. There are a million ways to solve it, but they all have one goal in common, to reach the solved state. In a few minutes, we will reach that solved state and get our diplomas, but we each have our own unique high school journey. There are four main steps analogous to the four years of high school. And the first step is to build a cross, a foundation around which you can build your high school career. There is plenty of leeway in where you can start, whether you are geared more towards the arts, or humanities, or sciences. Sophomore year allows you to expand on these foundations, pairing corner to edge and piecing together more and more components towards your ideal future. After just two steps, you have two-thirds of the cube solved, and you feel so close to graduation, but the road ahead only gets more difficult from here. Junior year is where things start to get messy. Standardized tests are taken, College searches run rampant, and athletes start to perform at the varsity level. More steps are needed to solve junior year, and it becomes easy to lose your place. But eventually, you orient the pieces correctly, and you're left with senior year, permuting the pieces into their final spots. From college applications to AP courses, describing senior year is easier said than done. But with one complicated algorithm, it's all over and we have finished high school. Your experience 
these past four years may have felt like forever. But then you realize that high school life flashed by in a matter of seconds. Whether you thought high school was the best four years of your life, or whether it's experience was your biggest challenge, knows that the road ahead will not get any easier. Whatever path you pursue, whether it's furthering your education, going into service, or starting a career or family, <laughs> will bring about brand new challenges that will test your character and skill to new levels. Take what you have learned from them so far and use them to your advantage. Protect your family name by protecting your good character. And there is nothing more fulfilling than a life without regret and a life with joy. I wish you, the class of 2015, all the best. Thank you, and congratulations.